I think it was Dave Emery did a good explanation one time about this. And here's what it represents. This is the bullet's line of flight. This finger represents a side force from the wind. So you launch your bullet and here is the wind blowing at a right angle from the right. Now you've got something going on already with your bullet, which is the barrel's twist rate. The rifling is spinning your bullet to the right in almost all rifles these days. And that already gives that bullet a little bit of shift at the tip. And then it's flying down range, not perfectly straight. And this is influencing a little bit of direction called spin drift. Now, if you hit it with that crosswind at the same time, what happens, and the reason I have my thumb up here is that there's a right angle response to this. That pressure is making that bullet go this way. So you get a little bit of lift in your bullet, very tiny. But again, after a thousand yards, it starts to add up. So you get a little bit of lift.